Hi, this is Brent with Lunacy Audio. Let's take a look at the sounds page with Inside of Cube. At the heart of Cube's engine is the sounds page. We can view sounds globally in the overview panel, and we can also make specific adjustments to each individual sound layer in basic and tweak mode. Each sampler comes equipped with an arpeggiator, filters, envelopes, step sequences, reverse, monophonic, glide, pan, and tuning controls. Back in the global editor, I can adjust each corner, such as randomizing the sound sources, reversing, and more. If I go to a sample layer, I can hit this key here and randomize the sound for that sample layer. I can also reverse those samples. And if I wanted to, I could reverse all of these globally. In addition to this, I have a global envelope, and a global volume control. In the basic view, I have controls such as solo, reverse, loop, and monophonic in the main sample head here. I can also change the sample star and end markers within the actual sample itself. And then I have an individual envelope control for each individual sample layer. In addition to this, I can solo the individual sample whilst listening to it and make adjustments to the tone. Here, I'm making high pass and low pass filters and the color sets the form and filter intensity for this corner. I can also tune all individual samples manually here, as well as pan them. In the tweak view, I can take my sample even further with controls such as the arpeggiator, arpeggiator presets, and loop time controls. Here, I'll speed the loop time up. I can also make these dotted or triplet. The arpeggiator comes equipped with six different modes. I can also change the octave, the swing, and the number of steps in the arpeggiator's pattern. In the arpeggiator presets folder, I can load up a specific sample designed for this corner. And lastly, I can change the key range of the arpeggiator sequence. Once I've made adjustments to a specific corner, I can right-click the corners to copy and paste certain settings in the global editor. For example, here I can copy the loop settings, the modulations, or even the corner sound. I'm going to copy the loop settings. And I'm also going to copy the modulations to another layer.